Say good morning, good morning, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> Happy Wondering Wednesdays. My name is Miss Sam. I'm Autumn and I'm sick that my birthday is almost. It just happened. Your birthday just happened. And what grade are you in? First grade. And, and first grade. And my birthday's on September 19th. Very good. So, so we have our little house for this chick. Yep, and so we're going to talk about some sunlight and being able to build structures that can actually... So we build it from last time at night time with Priscilla, mm -hmm. our mommy's friend Priscilla. Mm -hmm. And so... She's in her school. Yep, and so what I want you guys to see is we're going to talk about some sunlight. But first, let's remind ourselves of a couple rules. Yep. And let's also remember to get one rule. Be curious. Oh, we're gonna have, we're gonna talk about the rules. All right. Be curious. <gasps> and rule number two. Be observant. Get our observation goggles on. Mommy, that's a fall. And that's a oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! <laughs> and rule number three <laughs> is to ask questions. Hmm. Mommy, I know. I know how to question up no. Oh, you notice. What do I notice? What do I wonder on Wondering Wednesday? <laughs> All right, so today we're going to talk about sunlight. We are going to make some observations about the effect of sunlight on the Earth's surface. Okay? Hmm. When you think of sunlight... Hey, mommy, can I tell them something that you told me about the dinosaurs die? Well, that doesn't have to do with sunlight, but... But can I tell, you, can I tell them it? Okay. So, when the dinosaurs die, my mommy and me tell me... My mommy tell me when we're, we're in the car. So, so mommy tell me when, when that big rock, when it goes into the earth. And then, when, um, when the gout, when the... When a galaxy and the sun comes up and then that's why they die. Yeah, she's talking about a big asteroid, right? So it's sometimes, it's interesting to really think about like how far away the sun really is. It's so far away, but yet when we go outside, what do we feel from the sun, Autumn? Hot. You can feel hot. You can feel heat from the sun, right? And so also sometimes... Tell me how I put my butts in how do you put your buttons on? Well, I don't know. We don't really need buttons, but if you want, we can button this. There you go. And there you go. Bam! Um, but this is a doctor's thing, mm -hmm. like from our toys, but it can be like the science um, jacket. Mm-hmm. It's a lab coat, right? But she has her, the real science Oh, no. It, yours is real, too. Okay. But I'm talking about you. It's just all white. Mm -hmm. And it has pockets. Mm, it does have pockets, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's get back to the lesson. Yep. So think about sunlight. Sunlight makes you hot, right? Mm -hmm. Well, but I but I know that the sun is in the earth. Like the sun is a, far from the earth. It's yeah. far away. Yeah, but mm -hmm. it's just like a, but it's just like the sun is like really far, far. Mm -hmm. But it can, but we can see it from in the earth. Yeah, we can see it. But it's important, should you look right at the sun? It's important. You actually don't want to look right at the sun because it can be damaging for your eyes. Okay? But when you look at it, it's too bright to see Yeah, it. so we don't look at it. You look away from it, right? But we can do like this, like a shade. Yeah, and that's why sometimes people but wear do, sunglasses do, too. Can I get something that I can help? That, sure. That, like, okay. That but one thing I want you to notice is that sometimes when you're outside in the sun, is some things get hotter. This hat. Ah, you can use a sun visor. You're right. Here, let me show you. I have, so, um, the, the, my best friend, Gimme, when we're trying to build a birdhouse. Mm-hmm. And then we have to use a sun visor. Yeah, but you can use a sun visor. Yeah, you can use a sun visor. Yeah, you can use a sun visor. And it makes a shade hat. Hmm, this is an interesting concept. So, like I was saying, is that when it's sunny outside, some things get really hot and some things don't. So I want us to think about
about why do some things get really hot and some things don't, okay? And then the second thing is you guys are going to use tools and materials to design and build a structure that Mommy, is going to, help me, like, to, I'll help you in just a second, that will reduce the warming effects of sunlight on an area. So this means we want to be able to keep an area cool. We want to keep it colder. Hold on, Autumn. I want to make it like a shade house. Okay, so you have a few things in your kit, okay? You have some, Autumn, you're getting ahead. Can you wait for a moment? But I don't want it to break. We gotta show them how the house works first, okay? Can you show them that part after? I appreciate your enthusiasm. I want that. I want your enthusiasm, okay? So you'll need in your kit. Autumn, can you tell them about the kit? You gotta turn to page. What page is this right here? This one right here? Six. 16. Okay, so on page 16. I just say, I just say 16. Yeah, good job. 16. So 1, 6, 16. Okay, come to the 16, en français. Um, um, Wait, see, so, so you're gonna break it. Be careful. Says. The 16, okay? All right. So turn to page 16, you'll see some of the things that you can use. You can use black paper. Can you repeat after me? Papier noir. Papier. Noir. 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 Very good. It's like cat noir like you say it. Very good. Like from Ladybug. You're right. And then here we have some white paper. Can you say papier blanc? Papier blanc. Very good. And then we also have a thermometer. You guys don't have this in your box, but some of you may have some at home. Okay? Thermometer. Then, excuse me. You can use, we have popsicle sticks and also some straws. And you can use anything else from home. So here's some other supplies that we collected to help us. Autumn, look. Come see. Come help. So I found a box. It was just a, a box that I get some coffee in. We have, what is this, Autumn? This is a wee wee pad from animals. You know, so they can go pee pee inside. We have cotton balls. These are little cotton balls. Um, we grab some aluminum foil. Aluminum foil from the kitchen. So, so we don't need this thing. Then, here's a, a plastic Mommy. container. Mommy, we don't need this thing. That's, this that is from the protein powder. It can be the bed like you close it. You have straws. We it's also like, have like cardboard. You can use a pizza box. This was a cookie box. Woohoo, cookies. They're so good, by the way. Um, But anything that you Mommy, can find from home to dish. make your wait, structure. Wait, this thing like a bed this thing you can't you're right all right so can you step to the side on so everybody can see i need you to step to the side i, really wanna I want you to do that do too it. so let's yeah. turn it sideways so you can step to the side right here okay very good okay thank you all right so when we talk about heat when you say it's hot you say il fait chaud say il fait chaud I can't hear you. Say il fait chaud. Il fait chaud. Il fait chaud. It is hot. When you're talking about heat, it's chaleur. 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 I see that man. It's like... Oh, it looks so hot. Right? <laughs> can you guys try to say that? Chaleur. Chaleur. It's hot. Heat. Right? All right. And then here we have temperature. 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 Come on, Autumn, I can't hear you. Temperature. 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 Très bien. Okay. But in order to have heat, you have to have energy. Say energy. Energy. 
Energy. Energy. Now, things that are hotter than other things have more energy. I want you to think about it. When you move around a lot, you have a lot of energy, right? And when you move around, you can get kind of hot. So, this is because the more you move, the more energy you have. You, you're using, and the hotter you get. Try that. Let me see you move around. Let me see. Go ahead. Boop, 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 boop. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> Where did you find a penny? Look at that. That's good luck. It was uh, under there. It was under there? Come on, stand up. Okay, so. My legs are tired. Your legs are tired? Oh, my goodness. Okay, so we are on page 17, and... I'm gonna show you some things that we had outside, okay? I'm gonna go grab it real quick. The All right. Water. Here's the first one. What? We have a container that is plastic, mm -hmm. and it's, what color, Autumn? What color is this? White. It's white. We painted it white. And inside, I put, what's inside of it? What is this? A thing? A thing? A thing? What is it? Mm -hmm. A thermometer. A temperature. Thermometer. 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 Okay. So this thermometer. Let me get a new page. container it was at it's getting hotter now but it was at 18 degrees Celsius which is specifically it is 66 degrees Fahrenheit Wait. it's kind of gloomy outside today it's not a lot of Sun let me get another one hold on wait She's writing on the September 18th. That's from the past. All right, so this one that was in the, what color is this container? Black. Black, right? How do you look say it. black en français? Whoa, look at that, look at that, look at that, look at that. This was at 22 at degrees Celsius, which is 70, 70 degrees Fahrenheit. Okay, now let me get one more. Smallest. 18 is the smallest. 
So that means that the thermometer oh. that was in the white container, it was the coolest. It was the coldest. The thing that's really interesting about light and colors. Next time, next time, can we make the, um, hold on. The black one, like, red, so I can, like, that one's, like, hot. You know, Autumn has a good idea. Maybe we should have done one that was in a different color. Maybe like red or blue or green. That's a good idea. We should try it again and try it with another color. Like, but like, like what is really interesting is that when we put the thermometer inside each one of these and put them both outside, the thermometer in the black container got hotter because the color black absorbs Can I see heat. That? I want to see that. Whereas the thermometer... Red? Uh huh. Whereas the thermometer in the white container, it got cooler. It got cooler because white. Hold on. Hold on. I need you to. You're holding it upside down like this. Because the color white, it reflects sunlight. So when you go outside with white clothing, you don't get as hot. Shh. Shh. And when you go outside with a black sweater on, you're going to be hotter. Okay? You can't see that one. Okay. So, speaking of light reflecting off, like the white container, one of the materials that Autumn and I used in this house that we made, what is this material on the outside, Autumn? What is this called? I don't know. The shiny stuff. This right here. You remember? The plastic. It's called foil, aluminum foil. And so we used it on the outside of our structure so that way the sun could really reflect off of it. Okay? Sometimes you see some people put this on their windows hello, so that way hello, they hello, can hello, save hello. energy. Hello? Hello? Shh. That way they can save energy in our house. So what your mission is to do is first, which one was hotter, Autumn? I forgot to record this. Noir or Blanc? Which one was hotter? Um, Blanc. I mean that one, the black. The black one, right? So I'm going to circle that one. This one was hotter, okay? And what you're going to do is you are going to make a house either for your chick. Hold on. Can you stop talking while I'm talking? What is it? We're going to try that next time, okay? Put it down. Okay, so you're going to make a house either. Please stop talking while I'm talking. You're going to make either a house for your car or for your chick. Your choice. We made a house for the chick, okay? Autumn, can you tell them about your house, please? It's your time to shine. Come on. You don't want to show them the bed that you made? She made a bed for the chick, too. Okay. So while we're waiting for her to come up to talk to about the bed for the chick, we made the out the house out of cardboard, and then we have aluminum foil on the outside to reflect the sunlight. Can you stop making noises while I'm talking, please? Then we made the walls double layer on the inside using toilet paper rolls, and we also have the 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 wee wee pads. This one, we use the wee, wee pad like this because it's white, so it could reflect off of the light. And then also the cotton balls, we use this because they're white too, and they help reflect some of the heat. And so now the chick can go inside of the chick's house. You can make a bed if you want, that's your choice. <laughs> But the chick can go inside of the house, and if we put the chick outside, uh oh, the chick is tipped over. Let's make sure the chick is standing up. There you go, little chick. Can chicken. I try something with like that? Uh huh. And so now, if I put this outside, the chick is going to be much cooler than if we put it outside without this house. Okay? Autumn, can you show them the bed you made? Or are you going to show them how the chick works? Very cool. Go, go, go. Oh. <laughs> that 
that wind up toy is fun, right? So think about any kind of materials you want to make. Yours doesn't have to be this big at all. It can be smaller. You can use a shoe box. You can use one of the containers like we did here with this house. Maybe this is your house for the chick, okay, or for the car. And you could put it inside, and that will be its house. And that's fine, too. Be creative. All right, can you back it up, Autumn? Autumn, can you back it up? <laughs> you want to tell them about the bed you made? Like, can I show them that we just made? That's that's for second grade. Can you show them um, the bed that you made? What can I just do? I want to show she made a bed. It's so sweet. She put little cotton balls on it so it could have a little pillow. Little soft pillow. <laughs> All right, you guys, I hope you had so much fun. And I really look, not right now. I really, really look forward. Oh, and can you tell them about this real quick? Come see. So this is even an idea with sunlight. And see, it can keep my face cooler because I'm protecting it from the sun, right? If I wear this, isn't that, am I cool? I got little, little unicorns on there. I like it. <laughs> All right, you guys. Please take a picture or video of your structure, telling me about it and telling Autumn about it and explain why does it help keep the chick or the car cool. So you could say, okay, the aluminum foil keeps the chick cool because it reflects sunlight. The cotton keeps the chick cool because they're white and they also reflect the sunlight. Okay, and we made this shade so that way the chick can be protected from the sun's heat. All right, you guys, if you have questions, you can unmute yourself, but otherwise, have a happy wandering Wednesday.